Imagine if you could be in two places at once. It sounds like science fiction, right? But in the quantum world, this is not just possible. It's a fundamental rule of nature. Welcome to the bizarre world of quantum superposition, where particles defy our everyday understanding of reality. What does it mean? How does it work? And what does it say about the very fabric of the universe? Let's unravel this quantum mystery together. What is quantum superposition? In classical physics, the physics of our everyday world, a ball can only be in one spot at a time. But in the quantum realm, particles like electrons or photons follow a different set of rules. Superposition means that a particle doesn't choose a single state, but exists in all possible states simultaneously until we measure it. Picture a spinning coin. While it's spinning, it's not heads or tails, it's both. In the quantum world, a particle behaves like that spinning coin, existing in multiple possibilities at the same time. But as soon as you measure it, it collapses into one definite state, like a coin landing heads up. The famous double slit experiment. The most famous demonstration of superposition is the double slit experiment. Scientists shone a beam of light or electrons at a screen with two slits. If the particles behaved like tiny marbles, they would pass through one slit or the other, forming two distinct lines on the back screen. But here's the catch. When the particles weren't observed, they acted like waves, creating an interference pattern, as if they passed through both slits simultaneously. However, the moment they were observed, the interference vanished, and they behaved like particles again. It's as if the particles knew they were being watched. What causes the collapse? This brings us to one of the biggest questions in quantum mechanics. What causes the collapse of the wave function? Why does a particle in superposition choose a single state when observed? Some physicists believe the act of measurement forces the particle to decide. Others suggest that the observer's consciousness itself might play a role. A leading interpretation, the Copenhagen interpretation, argues that quantum mechanics doesn't describe reality itself, only the probabilities of different outcomes. But there's also the many worlds interpretation, which proposes that every possible outcome happens, but in separate parallel universes. Mind-boggling, isn't it? Real-world applications of superposition. Quantum superposition isn't just theoretical, it's the foundation of modern technologies like quantum computing. In classical computing, a bit can be a zero or a one, but in quantum computing, a quantum bit or qubit can be both zero and one at the same time, thanks to superposition. This allows quantum computers to perform calculations at speeds unimaginable for classical systems. Superposition is also vital in quantum cryptography, ensuring secure communications by leveraging the uncertainty of quantum states. Even technologies like MRI machines have roots in quantum principles, showing how the weirdness of the quantum world directly impacts our daily lives. What does superposition tell us about reality? Superposition raises profound questions about the nature of reality. Does the universe exist independently of us, or does it require observation to become real? And if particles can exist in multiple states simultaneously, what does that mean for the concept of time and space? Physicist Richard Feynman famously said, if you think you understand quantum mechanics, you don't understand quantum mechanics. It challenges our deepest intuitions about how the world works. So, can particles really be in two places at once? The answer is yes, but only in the strange and wondrous world of quantum mechanics. It's a realm that defies logic, yet underpins the universe we live in. As we continue to study quantum mechanics, we uncover more about the unseen forces shaping our existence. Perhaps, understanding superposition will one day help us unlock even greater mysteries about the universe and about ourselves. Thank you for joining this exploration into the quantum realm. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, 
and hit the bell icon for more amazing content here on Explore the Bright Side.